This thing went, flew under the radar for a long while and then all of a sudden it surfaces. And these agreements have been made and millions have been spent and invested already. I want you to know that. Mm -hmm. This company has expended uh, huge sums, I understand. Maybe as much as 24 million or, or, or maybe even more. They have loan commitments of 10 million, I understand. Um, and they're seeking to raise more capital because they need about 60 million. So this thing was, was a go long before it reaches this stage. When it reaches the House and the Senate, as you know, the government enjoys the majority and it's, it's more than likely it's going to fly. And that is again a tragedy because the debate into the numbers like mm -hmm. you, mm -hmm like you say, should have been done in the house. That is where an analysis should have been given to them and say, look, <clears throat> based on this new formula that we're implementing, and again, we are not implementing, it seems, formula for the retail, um, but based on this new formula, these new controls, these new mechanisms, I'll tell you one good thing, I have to give them kudos, one good thing about the new formula is it provides a small sum for the um, for the Bureau of Standards. So it gives them some stream, some in income stream, so that hopefully they'll be able to strengthen yeah. their surveillance and their you know checks around to ensure that the, the consumers are getting um, value for money and getting what they're paying for.